Hi guys. I thought I'd go over the gear I'm bringing with me on the Enchanta Valley hike. Um, this is my whole loadout right here, complete. Uh, this is with the Helinox chair, and this is without the Helinox chair. I haven't really decided whether I'm going to bring it or not. Um, it's, you know, a pound, so it's a pound difference. Here's everything I'm carrying outside my pack. So the Helinox chair, a couple of knee braces, my wet weather gear, toiletries, electronics, stakes in line, first aid kit, and my water filter. Uh, also outside, I'm carrying my cook set, a pad, like a little knee pad thing, and you know, my bandana and my ground cloth from my x mid tent. I'm using a ever new uh, ultralight nine millimeter pot with a little uh, coffee pot inside of it. That's my little cozy to the right. It actually opens up so I can, you know, drop the pot in there and rehydrate my food. Um, I got a little, you know, actual filter, coffee filter, because I'm not really fond of the instant coffees or the tea bag coffee. So this system really works for me. I got my BSR stove along with it and, you know, a couple of tiny sponges I use for cleaning and a lighter. Um, that's everything I have outside or inside my pack. This is the um, bear canister from Barricade. Alan sent me this one. It's actually a little different than the um, Scout that they normally sell because it actually has a carbon fiber lid on it rather than the aluminum grade um, airplane material that they put on the top lid. So this is new and I'm just trying this out. It's about the same size of a Bear Volt 450, but a little bit bigger in volume. Um, but extremely lightweight. Um, other than that, everything else I've got here, my clothes, my sleeping pad, my sleeping bag, you know, um, little, all my other stuff, my tent, I've just basically stuck it in this compression sack. And I'm at 14.8 pounds so far. And that's, of course, before food and water. Anyway, um, that's it.